Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks, and I did a video on this today. Somebody wanted to know how to do a dotted line, and using the dotted line uh, doesn't work because it's not equal. Well, it does work, but I thought I'd show you if you didn't want to do it the other way, let's make a 12-inch circle and put it in the center of the page, which I always do. Double-click on your pen tool. Let's go to black. And let's go to 36 points. And let's go a dotted line. Now you can see the problem. Those two are closer together than the rest of them in spacing. So if you don't want to do it the way I did it today, let's make this thing 26 inches. And now look, they're a little more equal. And you could play with this, and you go, well, I don't need a 26-inch circle. And, uh, I mean, you could just kind of play with it just a little bit to get it perfect. Then you could take the whole thing, go to a range, and convert outline to an object. Now it's no longer a line. And then you could go back. Let's make it 12 inches. And they appear to be quite a bit equaler. Still a little bit, of but if it didn't matter, you know, the other way I did it, it'd be perfect. And, you know, you could probably still adjust this and get it maybe a little bit more perfect because it's always going to be on that top part. It's going to look funny because that's where the line starts and stops. And you could actually play with this with percentages. You know, you could make it 50% and just increase it a little bit till you're happy. Let's go 51%. Let's go 55. See, now these are too close together. So, but you could play with this quite a bit. And then you could go, because convert it to an object, and then when you reduce it, or expand it, they'll be the same equal amounts apart than they were before. Anyway, I hope that helped a little bit. Thank you for watching.